So a great source of more information about butterflies like the Monarch is the Audubon Guides Butterfly app. And here we have it on the iPad. It's also available for the iPhone. Um, and it looks about the same except, you know, on the iPad we have a much larger image. And here we see the male that I talked about earlier with the, with the two scent patches. Um, and you can scroll along and see the underside. Um, and every species, you can scroll through many pictures like this. So the other neat thing, both on the iPad and on the iPhone, is you can even enlarge the images. So you just hit the little enlarge button, double tap, and we get a nice enlarged image. And here we can see, with the adult, we also have the larva, the caterpillar. And Dan, you were asking earlier about more information. The great thing about this app is that if you click on the description here, there's just tons of information about every species including the monarch here um, and it highlights some of the things I was discussing when I let go of that monarch um, how they travel to Mexico how there's multiple generations to get back here to the north my favorite thing about these apps is how compact they are I used to have to carry a couple field guides in my backpack and now all I have to do is carry my iPhone um, with me in the field and with this I could uh, learn my butterflies so much more quickly than I, than I did a few years ago. It has everything here that I need. It's got reference material, it's got all the species, and I don't have to thumb through an index um, and pull it out of my backpack. I can just quickly go to the search mechanism and find the butterfly I need. And then there's just multiple pictures there um, for me to look at and figure out if, uh, if that is indeed the butterfly I'm looking at. So now learning your butterflies with these apps has just really become a snap. 